Okay. Hi, everybody. Um, I'm out here just um, chilling, by, chilling by myself tonight, <laughs> uh, drinking some wine, feeling good. Um, but I, I wanted to come with this topic uh, here again because um, <clears throat> I wanted to talk and discuss and discuss about something, and I wanted to make it perfectly clear <clears throat> about how. Um, about how nowadays um, women in today's society um, you know <clears throat> as as most would say they're they're going to go and um, live their best life now and um, you know just just live it up um, w within their early years and all of that. But, um, <clears throat> I wanted to say in this recording, too, that, um, I believe that most women in today's society, nowadays, they're not, <clears throat> they're not able to love even one man. W women in today's society in the year 2021, most women, they don't, they don't care or even... They, they don't care to want to love, truly love a man. Um, and, and, you know, and most would say that um, today's women are, are only out here to gain resources, um, to, <clears throat> to use a man's resources, um, to gain popularity or clout, um, Most of the time, most of the time, um, this, this is what, this is what these women are out here doing, and, um, you know, and, and I've, I've, I've gone on the internet, and, and I've seen a few women talk about polyandry and all that, but the thing is, if you're, if you're, if you're a woman, if you're a woman who quote unquote thinks she can love multiple men, then um, I don't know. I guess you'll you I guess you're just gonna have to find some men who are gonna be okay with that because um, um, you know we all hear the term monogamy a lot, and um, that's when. That's when, t that, that's when, um, you know, a man and a woman are together and, and they get married and they don't have other partners. But the thing is, is that under monogamy, it's, it's more than likely that, um, either or a partner is going to cheat on the other partner because, um, I, I'm thinking within these marriages and all of that, like, it's just, I don't know, like, the man and the woman, the man and the woman just cannot be, like, they can't be transparent with one another. It's just, like, I don't know, it's just, like, in a way, it's just, like, there's no peace. There's no peace. There's no coexistence within the relationship at all, and this is, this is what, you know, this is the problem. This is what... This is what today's society in the dating market has a problem with. Um, so, I have to say this again. If you're a woman, if you're a woman who is even semi-spiritual, because you need to be super spiritual, you know, or, or at least believe in the Most High, um, you're going to have to be, you're going to have to be a woman who believes in the Most High um, in order to think that you can, that you are able to love, uh, multiple men, because, I don't know, to put it like this, if, if you're a woman who believes in the most high, and, um, you think that you, you're able to love, like, more than one man, then, 
straight away, straight away, you're going to have to think, okay, well, if I have multiple husbands, then my husbands are going to have to have multiple wives. You know, period, point blank. So, I mean, you know, as, as the divine feminine, you're supposed to take care of your man. You're supposed to take care of him and, you know, just, just be considerate of, of what he wants. Like, that's just not, it's, you know, it's, that's not a hard thing to do. So... So if you're a woman who, if you're a woman who believes that she can um, be in a polyandrous relationship with, um, you know, <clears throat> how many husbands you, that you want, all, all of your husbands, all of your husbands are going to have to have multiple wives. Because they, they you know... It makes sense. They they all can't be with with one woman. It doesn't make any sense. You know, say like <clears throat> say like three or four hus three or four of your husbands. You know, they wanna you know be intimate and everything, but you're the only one there. Like you're gonna have to you know as a wife to these husbands, you're going to have to supply like these other wives that you may have found for them. You know, it, it only makes sense. You know, and you have to be, you know, you have to be a respectable wife at that. You know. You're going to have to be, a, you know, as a wife, as a wife of the Most High to these husbands, you're going to your husband's. You know, and your sister wives' husbands, because, you know, the sister wives, you know, that's their husband, those are their husbands too. So, if you want to take care of your husbands, um, you know, you know, provide respect, um, you know, cook clean, usual, uh, wifely duties. So, you know, give your man love, you know the usual and before I end this recording I just have to say um, you know it's 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 quite apparent and, it, and it's obvious like mm. but me yeah I, I'm 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 in a monogamous I'm in a monogamous relationship and that's you know that's the most common way that's the most common way to be in a relationship but I know that you know I know that people around the world I know that people around the world are being poly so but it's just like most of the time, it's just like most people don't know how to conduct themselves in a, in a polyandrous relationship or, you know, a polyandrous relationship. Like, most people just don't know how to conduct themselves. And it's just like you, before you go into this, and and this is more spiritual for me. This is, um, this whole thing is more spiritual for me than than it is physical. But I'm just saying, like... Um, you know, both, both parties need to know, like, how to conduct themselves in, in these particular relationships, and they need to know how, like, they, they need to know how, like, the whole structure works before they even get into this kind of thing. Alright, so that's, that's all I wanted to say. Um, thank you guys for listening, and, um, you know, I'll post another one here later. Or sometime soon. Yeah, you know, what whatever's on my mind, you know. Whatever whatever's on my mind, I'll just do a recording and I'll and I'll think about it, but yeah. Um that's it for now. And um I'll see you guys in another one pretty soon. Have a good night.